So today we're showing off all the weird, hopeful, sometimes successful strategies that my brain has concocted over the week. We didn't have enough games to really give each one their own video, so we'll honor them all in one big video. Hopefully you'll get some ideas to try yourself, or maybe just hang out and enjoy the runs. Either way, glad to have you here. Let's jump right in. I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know what that means. And there it is. Lovely. Oh, double bluebird. Into a bunyip. Not interested. So the beauty of this setup is the bunyip passive goes off and then this basilisk goes off. So it actually works out pretty well. He gets health and then extra health. I mean, that just seems like a great combo. Throw you in. I think we get rid of you. Do it like this. You're going to get three triggers because you're going to go... No, you're Trumpets. I thought <laughs> I misread that. Alright, Groundhog can go then. Bunyip level is huge. I think the Bluebird is listening. And every time I say that one of these pets needs to go, it's like, hey, <laughs> let me buff him. <laughs> That's my new target. Target acquired. <laughs> Doesn't it feel like that sometimes? I don't know. Maybe I'm just crazy. But it definitely feels like it. Fantastic news. Beautiful. Could not have written it up better myself. Yeah, tier 3 probably ain't happening for y'all. Hate to be the bearer of bad news. Um, the only one I'd consider is Bluebird. Even then, I don't, I don't think it's gonna happen. Level me. Um, are we going Chimera again? We don't have any setup for it, so I'm gonna say no. See, this is how you know it's fixed. <laughs> when it doesn't feel good to run a Chimera with no setup. Just because you know it's gonna work. Love it. This weekly's feeling pretty good so far, I have to admit. Um, yeah, again, you're. What's another two trumpets gonna do for us? Nothing. Unicorn. Only really valid with the microbe, if the enemy's playing microbe. Or if we're playing microbe. You give 6-6 six, six a turn. The three pets. Is that even good at level three? I don't think so. <laughs> that doesn't feel good. I'll throw him in because it could be good in like an off situation, but yeah, I don't know about that one. Give you a fig, I think. Just because. I think he's sticking around. So it can't hurt. I guess that's not true. It definitely could hurt. Alright. Still at five hearts. Let's see. None of this looks appealing. We're just gonna roll a bit. See what kind of stuff we can come up with. So far, it's looking like not a whole lot. Really not a whole lot. Here to you, throwing a cappy. What do we got here? You go whale. Alright, yeah, let's run a whale. I'm gonna go whale stilt is our, our setup here. See, dude, you can't just run a Chimera anymore. You gotta move on, the time has passed. Level you. A zebra, huh? I wouldn't mind swapping the stilt with somebody else. 
I just don't have anybody yet. Not interested. Oh, Waylon. I don't think we need the zebra held. I don't know who I'm getting rid of yet. Oh, he's got big snipes. Is it enough? No, it is not. <laughs> Would have needed some garlic or something. That was just figs, by the way. That was no snipe pet. Just throwing a boatload of figs out there. Call it a day. Um, let's get rid of you. I think what I'm learning is we definitely need to get some more stats on you. So we're going to try that out. Roll me some more. Another cow seems great. And I mean, maybe the bunyip needs to go. Maybe the whale needs to go. <laughs> whale is getting massively owned by all of these snipes. But I just gotta level up, so now I don't want to. Okay. Tell you what. Throw you in the mix. Get rid of you. And then let's just grab a lizard. <laughs> He's just going to be there to soak up a whale trigger. Finally, no snipes. Almost. We actually almost drew that one. That was a big rock, by the way. Uh, let's see what we get. I guess we'll grab a hot dog. <laughs> Whatever. Um, start it. Start me out here. I'm looking for Quetzalcoatl. If you can find one, let me know. Okay. I think we're good. Beautiful. Lovely mathing out there, Mr. Bear. I found him. Start me with the level. Let's do this. And this. Throw in you two. Oh baby. It's happening. Now we need a good tier three, maybe a Tamarin. Pre-nerf Tamarin, for sure. Post-nerf Tamarin, doesn't feel quite that good. Hey, I respect it, he got the Leviathan. Definitely didn't need that kind of murder um, <laughs> to beat me. All right, get rid of you, freeze you. We're looking for a good tier three. Roll me. Roll me. Dolphin, I guess. Freeze me, maybe. Could do another camel. Start out with a dolphin. This would be perfect with a Jersey Devil build, by the way. He didn't commit to the Leviathan. Um, okay. So at this point, we can, any level three we get is going to be, any tier three or lower is going to be level three at the end of the round. So what if we do, get rid of you. Roll me. What kind of level three? I mean, Stoat is the big one. I don't know who else. <laughs> Maybe a Tamarin. Throw him in there just for fun. Okay. 
I guess we're going to Tamarin. There's the stoat. Okay. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> all in all, not actually that bad. As long as this doesn't hit you, we're good. Beautiful. We won the 50-50 coin flip. Okay. I love that these are identical. So now you're at least going to be somewhat high leveled. Not sure what we're doing with these chocolates. Maybe we just do this. That way we can actually combine them if we need to. Roll me. But if we don't need to, then they just get extra stats. Stoat max level. Love it. Alright. That's unfortunate. We almost saw the beauty of it. Groundhog. Love it. Other groundhog. Dude, I just... There's something about the base and the, the golden packs. They just feel good, you know? You know, you get bluebirds, you get groundhogs. It just... And mosquitoes, too. Something about it just feels nice. Um, let's do this. Love that. The key is to use your Quetzalcoatl. I'm <laughs> calling the Basilisk on the pets that are not in battle effects. That's how you get the value. Love me. A tree seems pretty good, actually. I'll freeze him. Now, I wonder how this works. Will this guy turn him into a rock? Yes, he does. Now, was that random? That's the follow-up question. Not sure. Okay. Level you. Camel tree is a fantastic combo. Who do we get rid of? Probably Mosquito. I don't think Mosquito is necessary here. Give you a Meat Bone. And an extra one attack. Thank you, Bluebird. Huge. Alright, we gotta get this tree stacked up a little bit here. Level you. Blowfish, camel's a natural, but I think I'll go skunk here. Is it better than the basilisk? Turns you into 3-6. Yeah, I think skunk is better. Roll me. Huge. Oh baby, we're doing it. No, nope, bluebird, you gotta hit the tree. You're missing the mark. Fantastic. Do 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 do. Charge. Level me. Throw you in. I mean, is this a unicorn angle? Surely not. Nobody actually gets ailments this weekly, from what I've seen in my limited experience. The only way to really get it is with microbe, and let's be real. <laughs> Have you seen a single microbe? Because I haven't. They're hiding. It's all just a lot of snipage. Alright, roll me. Hmm. Empty space manta turn. I haven't played a whole lot with the manta ray. I'll level you. Alright. I'll bite. 
it here. Thank you. Somebody's hitting it. And Bluebird don't. <laughs> he just picks out the worst possible pick. He's like, this is the one. I know what I have to do. I just don't know if I'm strong enough to do it. Roll me. Level. Give a random friend 3-3. Three, three. Let's sell you, see what we get here. Not interested. We're gonna do a weird little thing here, okay? We're gonna do this. <laughs> uh, and then roll me. We're gonna get like a little conga line of buffs, right? So you're gonna buff you, which you're gonna buff you, and then it's gonna be great. And then the tree cleans up. Hey, this is a pretty good combo. You can't tell me it's not. Roll me. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Um. I mean, I'll dragon. Throw you here. Throw in a little basilisk action. We gotta watch out. Make sure you don't get above 12. But aside from that. We're cooking. Lovely. Lovely news. Is there any tier 5 we want from the stoat? Maybe a triceratops? But I kind of feel like we're just going for the one drops at this point. Hold on to the avocado in case we miss. We did not miss. Found a Triceratops too. That's huge. The reason these are in the back, by the way, if you were wondering, is because this is a random friend. You want him to be at the very back. So it's guaranteed, right? He broke my stuff. How rude. Okay. So now I'm starting to realize the error of my ways. Because you are going to rapidly outgrow <laughs> your current um, allotment, should I say. Um, attack and health of all pets. Doesn't seem that useful. Throw you here though, give you a skewer. Love it. I mean, it's we're at nine wins. We're not gonna pivot at this point. <laughs> um, we have to ask ourselves if the coconut is that valuable. I mean, honestly, I would say yes. Or no, I would say it's not. I think I would rather just do this. And then drop you in here just cause. Maybe the, the piranha would have been better <laughs> than a stoat. I think we're good. We got the conga line, dude. <laughs> the conga line's pretty solid. I love that. Bluebird Basilisk Bluebird Part 2. Nice, buffing each other. We'll be some underwater boogeymen. Aren't they normally underwater? Aren't they like a... I don't know, this like moss creature or something? I might be thinking of something else, I'm not sure. Alright. Run a little bunyip action. Thank you for buffing good ones. Very kind of you. Huge. We gotta win. We actually did it. And then combine you. Run a tree. Get rid of you. Throw you in the mix. Okay. 
Did I do my math wrong? <laughs> I really thought I had to sell somebody there, but now I suddenly have four guys. Not sure where that messed up here, but okay. It's not a huge issue. I like a swan. Maybe save a little meat bone for him. I think we lead with the camel. Ooh, thank you. Alright, maybe we should not have led with the camel. <laughs> Whatever, I don't even care. Roman. Level me? We could try unicorn play here. I'm down to give it a go. I think we try it out. If it works, great. If not, kind of anticipated that, you know? You don't feel like hitting the, the kangaroo? No? <laughs> With the fig? Alright. Roll me. Don't need another bluebird. Um, that's pretty good. It's not bad at all. Roll me. Now we're talking. We're up to three wins out of seven turns. That's not great. Roll me. There it is. That's what we're looking for. Um, get rid of you. Throw you in the mix with... I don't actually think we need any of this. I think we're just rolling. Unicorn's great. I think we run it like this at first. Maybe he gets sniped and ruins everything, maybe not. Once the... Once the unicorn gets cooking a little bit, we can do something more crazy. Well, <laughs> apparently that wasn't even needed. Um, yeah, so I think the tree eventually is going to have to go to make our microbe fit. I don't want to get rid of him quite yet. But of course the, the fig is going to be key here. For extra value. I mean, a skunk seems pretty good. Okay, running like this. That actually worked out somehow. Don't ask me how, I don't know. I haven't the slightest clue. Okay, now, here's what we're going to do. Get rid of you. We don't need you. We will, just not yet. Throw a snapping turtle in the mix. Give the, the swan a little something something. Another unicorn would be pretty cool right now. Just throwing it out there. Well. <laughs> yeah, this is very susceptible to sniping. Which if you haven't played this weekly yet. Just know that sniping is very prevalent <laughs> this weekly. Um, and that is an understatement. Okay, so now... Dude, it keeps... See, this is what I mean. I can't get any of it working because it's just so many snipes. They're everywhere. Too many. Start me here. Freeze you. Be 
can't beat him, join him. That's the motto, right? Alright, that'll do, I guess. We need to get this unicorn cooking ASAP. Okay. Unicorn? Unicorn? Anyone? Anyone got a unicorn for me? Whale in the front. Interesting. Not bad. That will do it. We're up to eight wins. That's huge. Roll me. Unicorn. Honestly, I think that's all we're actually looking for, is just a unicorn and or chocolate. Come on. Come on. That hurts. I mean, I'll take a skunk, don't get me wrong. But unicorn is a little bit more important. Okay, they don't really have any snipes. Especially after that. If we could get an extra one of these snapping turtles too. <laughs> that might help us out a little bit. I'm um, now realizing that he's a level one. Okay, start out with you. We did find a snapping turtle. Mmm, that was premature on the chocolate, huh? I think we're good. I'm honestly not sure what's happening, but it, it seems to be in our favor, so I'll let it happen. <laughs> I'll let it slide. Um, Alright, so here are all the unicorns. I found them. If you're looking for any, they're right here. There we go, okay. Now I can't really complain about anything. Now we're just looking for some snapping turtles. That's scary, but I think we're okay. Ooh, a little too much snipage, but we were close. I'm honestly just surprised we didn't get immediately murdered by those leopards. I'm not entirely sure how that happened. Roll me, does not upgrade on leveling. Yeah, that's true, that's true. This one we might be able to work with. Man, <laughs> this is not good. We're stalling. We are stalling out at the finish line. This is not what you want to see. What do we got for us? All right, I guess. I guess we'll throw a peach in here. Thank you. Okay. Now we're straight up just getting whatever. I don't even. Do we even have held foods <laughs> or non-held foods? We got a cupcake. We'll put that on next turn if we need to. I'm more just hoping there is no next turn, but that may be <laughs> hopeful, wishful thinking. What do you got for us? We do a 2-2 peach or we give attack. Straight up. Run it. Don't even need chocolate. I'll throw a cupcake on you though. Don't think I won't. This is the weekly of held foods and cupcakes. This is terrible news. <laughs> oh man. So we got this this weird build going. The figs did help a lot. I don't know. I don't know if the unicorn scaling really does it, you know? It's such a large setup and it just gives 2-2 two, two every turn to three guys, which is like, is basically a giraffe, not a giraffe, <laughs> dragon. It's basically a dragon, um, but worse. Yeah, I don't know about this whole unicorn business here. 